Hello friends, welcome to Brighter API. I am Milin Mehta. In this tutorial, we will learn the plus minus algorithm. So let's go to our HackerRank account. Okay. So it says that given an array of integer, calculate which fraction of elements are positive, which fraction elements are negative, and which fraction elements are zero respectively. Print the decimal value of each function, each fraction on a new line. Okay. So let's try to understand it by input. They are inserting a six value. Say so they have inserting a six. After that they are inserting a minus four, three, minus nine, zero, four, and one. In this there, there is a minus four and minus nine, which is a negative value. Three, four, and one, which is a positive value, and zero is a zero value. Zero value. Okay. So they, what they are expecting is that three divided by six, which is a positive num positive number count, which is a three, and total number of the count they have insert, which is a six. So zero point five and the decimal. Okay. 2 divided by 6 which is a negative number count which is a 2 and total number of the count which is a 6 0 double 3 double 3 double 3 with the decimal and 0 0 number of count which is 1 divided by total number of count which is a 6 is equal to 0 1 double 6 double 6 7 so what we will do what we have uh, what they have done till now here that which is the integer n is equal to they have taken a uh, total number of count what they will take which is a six array they have taken one array and okay, I, I will just remove it for the uh, okay, let, let, let it be here and what they have do that they are taking of uh, uh, all the values in the loop okay so now we want to take uh, all the positive number negative number and the zero number of the count so what we will do we will do that array of i which is less than zero then it is a negative number so what we will do negative negative count plus plus else if their number which is a positive so it should be array of i which is greater than zero we, we, we need to increase the positive count and if the number is 0 so array of i is equal to is equal to 0 and we will increase increase 0 number of count okay. so what what we have done till now that we have the count of the total number of positive number of count total negative number of the count and total zero number of count okay now what we will do we need a division and the total number of the division what we will what we want that let's try to understand that let me try to print it print ln and we need that positive count positive count divided by n okay okay so let's try to understand that and uh, some more decimal and precision concept is there so let's try to understand this output first okay so what it says what it says they have inserted six and this number and they we are they are expect uh, our output is zero it should be a 0 0.5 right but it is not expect as expected so what we will do for the initially we want to understand it to float number one okay float number one is equal to zero f okay and number one will store the, this value okay and we need to cast with the float float and we need to print here number one ok so even though it is written in the 0 0.5 that was a integer so it was not written in uh, it was written in a 0 now it is a 0 0 0.5 ok but let me let me uh, focus on the System dot out dot print 
ओके इट इज अरो पॉइंट फाइव एंड वॉट इज द एक्सपेक्टिंग आउटपुट विच इज अरो पॉइंट फाइव डबल जीरो डबल जीरो डबल जीरो ओके सो हियर इज द कंसेप्ट बिटवीन दी प्रिंट एल एन एंड प्रिंट एल सो लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड इट बाई नेक्स्ट लाइन वॉट इज द डिफरेंट बिटवीन दी प्रिंट एल एन एंड प्रिंट एल प्रिंट एल एन विच इज अ न्यू ब्लैंक लाइन देन योर मैसेज वॉट वी आर डूइंग इज दे इन द that print ln which will print a value in the new line and print f if you remember it print f was the function in the c okay so what print f do it is it is a providing a special formatting for that print f is primarily needed when you need to print a big string to avoid a concatenation in the print ln so that's why we need to use here a print f okay so we will not use a print l ln here we will use a print f okay so we will take a three values number 2 which is a, is equal to 0f because we want to print all the number of the count all the output okay and number 3 which is a 0f okay uh, we will need to number 2 equal to load which is a negative count divided by n and here we will print a zero count okay we will okay and it will print like this okay we need a till a sixth precision so as we was defining in this c we will define it same like that percentage point 6f okay so it will print in the 6 okay and number 2 and number 3 still it will give you an error let's try to understand by the code okay so let's first the initially run the code and you will try to under, you will get an error and you will understand it okay oh it is uh, saying that system dot out dot intel and compile time error on this system dot out dot eri and t we have written lf okay so that's why it was saying an error okay so let's again we print run it okay but it did not pass the value what it happens it was expecting a new line and we haven't print a new line because print ln is pre printing a new line okay and print f is not a printing a new line so what we will do here we will do slash n and this slash n okay let's run the code so here you can say that our test case has been passed so from this example you learned the decimal number pre different decimal number another concept that you understand the difference between the print ln and the print f what is the difference between the print ln and print f print ln is a ln is a use for the new break line and print f which is a string formatting similar to same as a print f which was we are using in the c and when you need to print a big strings to avoid a string concatenation and the print ln okay so let's try to submit all the code which is uh, let's check that it is pass all the test cases or not so congratulation we have pass all the test cases okay okay thank you guys thank you for watching my video please like share and comments my video and subscribe my channel thank you thank you thank you